This is Panther Weekly with Kentucky Wesley and head football coach Brent Holsclaw. Coach, can you talk about last week's 42 0 win briefly? Yeah, it was, uh, it was a, a questionable opponent in terms of uh, you know their stature as a program. Uh, you know, late in the summer, we had revised our schedule because of NCAA rules. So uh, that was a game we looked at trying to move, uh, but due to the lack of home games, and my ability to try to find one for, I believe it was on October 17th. Uh, we just went ahead and stayed with the game. Kind of went uh, as I expected. They had some nice athletes, uh, but I just don't think that they have the right amount of time to prepare for opponents. And uh, and certainly that showed in, in the contest. Uh, this weekend's homecoming weekend at home, you got Louisiana College coming in. Uh, could you talk about that really quick? Uh, very good football program. Well, very well coached, uh, really well disciplined. Uh, I'd like to think that we're very similar uh, in, in a lot of the way we do things and the way they do things. And right now, uh, we're keeping a close eye on Mother Nature. They're calling for uh, a lot of rain, which we're no stranger to that. We played that in Central State. We played in Randy Davidson. So it uh, should be an outstanding contest. We're looking, certainly going to be a much tougher opponent this week than last week. So we've got to be on our A game Saturday. If we do, it'll be a good homecoming victory. If not, then uh, uh, we'll get back to work next week. But it uh, should be an outstanding game Saturday. We're really looking forward to it. How important do you think it is to stop the run, especially if it is going to be raining tomorrow? i um, been really pleased with our defensive production uh, since the Limestone game. Uh, and we played a really tough Delta State game. Like they're in the top five right now in total offense in the country. But our defense has really stepped up the last uh, three or four games. We, you know, we shut out God's Chosen. We were able to hold Davidson to 14 points, seven points in regulation. And uh, we held Central State to seven points. So right now, uh, our rush defense is much improved than it was in the first uh, quarter of the season. And uh, our pass defense is better. So right now, uh, our defense right now, I've got utmost confidence in. They're really playing lights out. And uh, certainly going to need that Saturday as, uh, as Louisiana College is, is uh, very accustomed to putting points on the board. So uh, big challenge on both sides of the football for uh, Saturday afternoon. Defensively, who do you think has made the most strides overall? I, honestly, uh, we meet as a coaching coaching staff every week, and we, we try to single out the one guy who's made a difference in that ball game. In the last uh, three weeks, we've given our Defensive Player of the Week award, and from a coach's perspective, to our entire defense, um, everybody's really stepped up. And uh, I think a lot of that has to do with getting uh, early games against schools like Murray State and Delta State, where uh, you're really playing at a different level. You know, and when you get back to uh, our level of ball, that competition kind of shows. So. They really gelled well. Um, for me to sit here and pinpoint one guy would be unfair to the other guys because they've really come together well as a defense. I'm, I'm extremely proud of those guys. Offensively, is the game plan still to get the ball into the hands of Keelan Cole and Xavier Mitchell? The game plan is always to get the ball to Keelan Cole. Uh, what we have found out early on is the respect level that our opponents have for that young man uh, as he has been double and, and it's sometimes triple covered uh, even in our games against FCS schools and he's continued to do a pretty good job with that. Uh, what we've got to do is when he is being double covered, we've got to be able to run the football. We've got to be able to get the ball to other players. And most importantly, we've got to be able to protect Dalton. Uh, if we can do those things, then we'll be, it should be a great uh, you know, late stretch of the season for our football team. All right, Coach, thank you for your time thank and good you luck guys. tomorrow. Appreciate you.